Ukraine's YouTube channel. Fierce resistance of the Ukrainian armed forces continues in the region. The Russian army, on the other hand, started to rebel against the attack of the Ukrainian armed forces. Disobedience in the Russian military has increased drastically in recent times, according to the statements of a senior U.S. defense official. At the same time, with the weapons coming from the West, the blows of the Ukrainian armed forces on the Russian army are increasing. Experimental 2S22 Bodena self-propelled howitzer in the hands of the Ukrainian armed forces began to destroy the Russian front. The 2S22 Bodena howitzer was developed by Ukrainian engineers and stands out as a powerful weapon with 155mm NATO standard artillery caliber. According to published reports, the howitzer was in Russia's inventory. But he managed to be captured by the armed forces of Ukraine. It has been announced that the range of the missile fired from the howitzer is 40 kilometers. With remote attacks on the Russian forces gathered around Donbass, the Russian army can inflict heavy losses. These losses increase the morale of the Russian army day by day and cause the belief that the invasion will not be successful is spoken more loudly. In unofficial statements made by members of the Russian army, it is spoken that Russia should bring more than 900,000 soldiers to the region in order to invade Ukraine.